Hello everyone. Well, no, I can't decide to walk in front in my intro, so that's cool. <laughs> you can see his tail. Anyway, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> um, today I am here with a different kind of video. I've never done one of these like um, kind of mystery d stashes on Facebook before. Um, so now he's just gonna lay. Okay, you're just gonna get his tail because he's gonna lay right next to me. Um, he's loafing. So, anyway, I've never done one of these like mystery D stashes before where you just pay shipping. Um, so this bag wasn't labeled like ass wax or anything. She said it was from 2020 to 2022, and it could be like a different array of scents. So, I just got the mailer here. Um, and yeah, let's get into it. So I had a little bit leftover money from um, my birthday. My boyfriend's grandparents gave me $50. So I use some of that towards wax because it's something that I love. So $10.50 went towards shipping for this. So I'm excited to try this out. Um, she said it was stuffed full into me. This is not stuffed full. You definitely could have, there definitely could have been a lot more put in here. So that's kind of disappointing, but I mean, it is what it is. Um, I'm still excited to give some of this a try. So let's get into it. I'm going to pull out here. This is from um, MK's Body Sweets, which I've only had one other sample that was from my friend. Um, it was in a package that she sent me. It was like a little sample. I think it was called Raspberry Jam. Oh, she also sent me um, two hearts and like banana grape bubble gum. So I had two things from her. So this is pink lavender apple cake. And I'm not sure what kind of wax this is. It looks almost like beeswax or soy. But yeah pink lavender apple cakes. I'm not sure what pink, is it like pink sugar with lavender and then apple cake? My cat's just looking at me like I'm nuts. Let me see if I can show him without like, there he is. That's my cat. <laughs> uh, he's just like chilling next to me. It's almost his dinner time, so. Um, this I like you definitely get the lavender. I'm not really picking up much apple. This kind of leans a little bit herbal, kind of medicinal herbal lavender. It's pretty. It's it's not my favorite, but I like it. I mean, I love um, herbal lavender, you know, sweet lavender, all that stuff. But I wish I got more of the apple cake. So, put that back there. Next is... Uh, ooh, pumpkin honey butter from Better Homes and Gardens, which this scent hasn't been out. I think the last time it was out was 2021, 2022. I'm not sure. One of those years. But um, I did melt a clam through the, of this when it came out and I loved it. So you can't find this anymore. And this is so good. It's very like a sweet, rich, um, creamy pumpkin. It's definitely like a honeyed butter pumpkin. It's creamy. It's sweet. It's not spicy. It's got a little hint of spice, but not spicy like Red Hot. Just like a hint of it. And I love this. So I'm really happy to have um, a clamshell of this. And then we got... We got a Scentsy Bring Back My Bar in Root. 66 or route 66 however you pronounce it I'm not really familiar with Scentsy so I'll look this up actually hang on let me pull the tablet up one second okay so this looks like it's citrus herbs and musk um, I believe this was part of the Father's Day collection it looks like and this is nice. It's definitely a very green type fragrance. 
citrusy, musky. It's pretty strong. Um, it's different. It's pretty. Alright, next we have is a little scent shot cup, little sample in, if it will focus, why aren't we focusing here, persimmon salsa <clears throat> from Sassy Girl, excuse me, <laughs> he's just, the kid's just staring at me, ooh, this is nice, very citrusy, fruity scent. Oh, I like that. That's pretty. Um, so, and that's very strong, so. Now I got little wax pieces all over my dress. Oh my gosh. It just keeps falling all over the place. Alright. So there is that one. Oh, next from Rose Girls. This is from August of 2022, so not that old. Carbs, which is cookies, bread, and donuts. I never had carbs on its own, but I've had it in um, blends. Mm. This is so good. I love this. Cookies, bread, donuts. Yeah, it's very, very heavy bakery, sweet, rich, decadent scent mm, that's really good yeah I've never had that on its own so I'm really excited to have have that and it's really strong people say Rose Girls Bakery doesn't last but for me it's lasted I've had some since last year and it still performs very well so um, next we have Cookie Land which I have in my collection right now this is from 2020 it looks like oh uh, so yeah Ooh. you definitely get obviously the toffee butterscotchy pretzels it's very pretzely pretzel heavy I like it it's nice it's still pretty strong so definitely melt that on its own or it's like or it's a, would be a good blender. All right, we have next is from Super Tarts, American Werewolf in London. So it looks like this is a description. Yeah, okay. Pumpkin patch cake. Oh, pumpkin patch cake batter, vanilla ice cream, and cranberry jam. That sounds amazing. Mm. Okay, I'm not really... Not really sure. I don't smell cranberry jam at all. Maybe like a sweet, sweet bakery pumpkin scent. We'll have to see when I warm that. Um, but right now, as on cold, I don't get any. I don't get any um, cranberry jam. Also, I'm not sure how old that is doesn't have a date on it. Well, it looks like the last thing in here is, I don't know what vendor this is. So this is Morning Beignet, Pizzelle, and Country Cream. If anybody knows this label, what vendor this is from, let me know. And it's got these chunks in here because I'm not sure. But let's give it a sniff. Ooh, this is nice. It's like a, sorry if you hear that, my cat is scratching at a scratching post. This is nice. It's like a rich, creamy bakery. Yeah. Not much to it. It's kind of, well, I feel like <laughs> this video is kind of a bust. Um, really not much of a variety in here it's basically all like the same scent like these they're just I don't know that's that's it for this um, little mystery just pay shipping D stash 
I think that's what I'm going to call it. I don't know. But that was kind of disappointing. I'm not sure if I would get these again. It just, I don't know. I'm kind of sad about it. <laughs> I mean, I like some of the things, but then, I don't know. I just feel sad. Hmm. Disappointed. I don't know. I guess that's a chance, chance you take, right? But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this different kind of video. And yeah, I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.